Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find and use virtual backgrounds in your Zoom meetings. I recently got an email asking me how to do this, so I thought I'd make a little video on how to do it. Now, the first thing you should know is this is not available in Chromebooks. So if you're a Chromebook user, unfortunately, you're out of luck. So let's go ahead and take a look here at my Zoom account, and I'm going to just go in and host a meeting with my video on. So with my video turned on, I'm going to open my Zoom meetings here on my desktop, and we're going to launch my Zoom meeting. And there it is. Let's go ahead and join with my computer audio. And that's me. Now, if you want to get some backgrounds, there's a lot of places you could find them. You could go to a site like pixton.edu, or sorry, edublog.pixton.com, Pixton EDU's place for Zoom virtual backgrounds. You see lots of neat ones there. You could go to Pixabay and look for a high resolution image you want to use. You could use your own Google Photos or your own photographs, or you might go to Canva and use their template for a Zoom virtual background and use one of their designs. And this could be a great way to put up some information you want to have on the sidebar available to your students in the background behind you. You know, perhaps I want to have in some text next to me and say, I'm going to say, welcome to class. And then I put the agenda for the day on here. Okay, I'll put in one, we're going to do vocab words. And two, we're going to review for quiz. So we can do those sorts of things and maybe that'll be part of my background. And I can use some of my photographs in here as well. I have some of my own. Maybe I'll use uh, this picture here as part of my background. Or I'll use this one as part of my background. Point being, I want a high resolution image that I can now use in my background. So let's go to my Zoom now. And now that I have a picture that I want to use, let's go down to my video button. And we'll go ahead and choose virtual background. And here you can see some pictures I've previously uploaded there to my virtual background. You can see that picture I have with the airplane in it. There's another one I've uploaded, a picture of my dogs and some other pictures. But let's add another one. Let's do add image. And I'm going to go in and add this picture here that I'd like to use in my background. And there we are. So there's my new background for my Zoom virtual meeting. So that's how you can add virtual backgrounds to your Zoom meetings. As always, for tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.